of you have been asking me for my top 10 marijuana stocks. So are you ready? Because I was born ready. Here we go. Number 10, the Green Organic Dutchman, symbol TGOD. Now I know you're probably wondering, how come I can't find this stock? This is a brand new IPO. They're opening up any day. And the reason I like this company is they are number one in Canada with current growing potential. They're number one. They got the most growing potential right now. Not future growth. Future growth, they are ranked number four, just under a million square feet they can grow. So why do I like them as number 10? They're number one right now in how much they're growing every day. It's a brand new IPO and they just raised a record breaking $160 million for their IPO. Keep your eye on the Green Organic Dutchman, symbol TGOD. They're number 10 on my list, but they can move up very, very quickly, okay? Um, oh, another thing, they are fully funded and their expansion of their enormous facility is well underway, which is 970,000 square feet. That's right, 970,000 square feet, which makes them the fourth largest potential producer in Canada as far as square footage. So that's why for me, they are number 10 on this list, but the next time I do a list of top 10, they could be, they could be even as high as number one. It's true. That's number 10. Number nine. SNN or SNNVF in America, Seneva. The reason I like this, they call this the canopy of California. I know some guys that actually bought into this when they were just getting started before they did their IPO and they invested at a dollar. I believe today they're around $10, maybe a little bit less, maybe a little bit more. I know it's bouncing around $10, 9 and 11. I think this company is huge because California is the size of Canada. And these are one of the largest producers, Ceneva, that have a license to grow in California and in Canada. Because of that, I have to have Ceneva on this list. They exploded out of the gate. They've come down a little bit, but I think they have huge long-term potential. So keep Ceneva on your radar. SNN in Canada, SNN VF in America. They're number nine. Who's number eight? If you've been watching Rich TV Live, you know I love this company. I've been watching them since they did their IPO last year, and they did their IPO around a dollar. It went down to 80 cents. Right now it's trading around $2, and I still think it has so much potential. That's ABCAN, A-B-C-N in Canada, A-B-C-C-F in America, ABCAN. I absolutely love this company. They are up 178% since last year. That's correct up 178% since their original IPO. I love them. They are number eight on my list. They are working with Cannabis Wheaton, another company that I absolutely love and I own, and I do own Abcan as well. I love this company and I love the price. I think we can see blue sky from here. Abcan, put it on your radar, put them on your watch list. They're a big winner. Number seven, I love this company. Oganagram, OGI in Canada, OGRMF in America. I love the price right now. It's up 138% since last year. They currently have 227,500 square feet of growing capacity as we speak, and their future growth is 428,000 square feet, so they still have a lot of room to grow. I think this is a company that you have to have on your watch list. You have to have it on your radar. They are one of the largest producers on the east coast of Canada, actually located in Moncton, New Brunswick, one of the only producers in that region of the whole country. So I think they've got huge growth potential, and I think the price is good. So OGI, Organogram, number seven on my list. And who's number six? I mentioned them earlier. Cannabis Wheaton, CBW in Canada, CBWTF in America. This company is enormous. Their strategy is sound. Invest in all the top producers. Sounds familiar, right? That's the rich system. That's what they do. They are up. Are you ready for this? They are the number one pick of 2017, up a staggering 
3,540% since last year. That's correct. Up 3,540% since last year. Unbelievable. I believe they are grossly undervalued and they are working very closely with ABCAN, which I just mentioned. This is why I believe CBW is number six and I love the price, just over, just bouncing between a dollar and two dollars. I think it's grossly undervalued. I love the price, and that's why I got them as number six. Number five, this one is a beauty, okay? I bought this one last year early, in January, at around two bucks. It went to three dollars, I sold it for a nice gain. Today it's trading well over $10. It's on the NASDAQ and it's up 627% in the last year. That's Kronos Group under the symbol Kron on the NASDAQ. The only one of these producers on my list that's on the NASDAQ do your research, guys. Cron, Kronos Group, they are a monster. Huge potential, huge players. I think that they're going to go all the way to the top. We could see them rise up on this list as well. But I got them ranked as number five, Kronos Group. You can book it. And who do I got as number four? This might be a surprise because I haven't talked about this company a lot, but I've been doing a lot of research and I was doing a lot of due diligence and this company came up on my list. They are Village Farms. Symbol VFF in Canada, VFFIF in America, rated as one of the top 50 companies on the OTCQX. I think this company has huge potential. It's up 313% in the last year. The reason why I love this company, they've got the largest growing potential of all the companies in Canada. Actually, I think it's second largest behind Canopy Growth Corp, and their growing potential is 1.1 million square feet of future growth. Currently, they are operating at 250,000 square feet of current growth, and I love this company. They're located in my backyard here in Delta, British Columbia, Canada, and I just love Village Farms. They're number four. Add them to your watch list. Put them on your radar. They're a big winner. All right, now we're back to the top three. Are you guys ready for this? In number three, and this is very hard, guys. I spent a lot of time putting this list together. There's a lot of different factors. I took into consideration price. I took into consideration management. I took into consideration share structure. I took into consideration growth potential, current growing um, revenues. I took everything into consideration to make this top 10 to bring you the best top 10 I could think of and I could research and these guys came up as number three and I love these guys. These guys just did a huge deal with Shoppers Drug Mart, one of the largest pharmacies in Canada. They are number three of Fira Inc, APH in Canada, APHQF in America, up 224% in the last year. One million square feet of future growth potential currently using only a hundred thousand square feet of their growing potential so they still got 90 percent more of growth potential i think this company is grossly undervalued i think this is a company you could see one day maybe as high as a hundred dollars in the next five to ten years maybe even sooner a fira i love this company add them to your watch list add them to your radar it's a big winner and you heard it right here on rich tv live you heard it here first Number two, everyone who knows me knows that this company is my number one pick of 2017. I've already said it's my number one pick of 2018. Anyone who knows Rich TV Live knows who this is, Aurora Cannabis. I love Aurora Cannabis. They're number two on my list. I would have liked to put them number one, but I just couldn't because number one right now is on fire and, and they deserve the number one spot. But Aurora Cannabis, up 468% in the last year and they have 943,000 square feet of future growing potential, currently only using 143,000 square feet. So I still think there's huge growth potential. One of the reasons why I put them number two ahead of a fire is the price. They're a little bit lower priced. They are doing a lot of big acquisitions and they just announced that they are also working with Shoppers Drug Mart. So I love Aurora Cannabis. Obviously they did a huge acquisition 
of Canamed, which is trading at two or three times higher the price of Aurora Cannabis. So I expect Aurora to skyrocket. I love this company. They're number two on my list, Aurora Cannabis, ACB in Canada, ACBFF in America. They're a huge winner. You can book it. Another company that I think one day you could see in the next five or 10 years at $100 plus. It's true. And last but not least, number one, the company that I've been talking about for over a year that I've been telling you guys is the LeBron James of medical marijuana stocks, and I was 100% correct. Canopy Growth Corp, W-E-E-D, the best symbol of all time, weed, T-W-M-J-F in America, up 411% in the last year alone. Total future growth capacity of 1.2 million square feet, which is number one in Canada, and currently utilizing 598,000 square feet, which is number two in Canada behind the Green Organic Dutchman. They're trading over $30. They've been as high as $40. They are the leader in the entire space. They're making more money than any other company in the world in the medical marijuana space right now. They are the leaders. They're the LeBron James of medical marijuana stocks. That's why they're number one. Canopy Growth Corp. Nobody can beat them. Everybody's chasing them. They are big winners. This is your boy, Rich. That's my top 10 lists of top 10 marijuana stocks in 2018. What do you think? Do you like my list? Now remember, Rich TV Live is strictly for education and entertainment purposes. We are not licensed advisors. Remember, do not buy anything you see on this show that I talk about. Buy something because you've done your due diligence, you've done your research, and you love it. But this list, this list is fire. All right, party people, this is your boy, Rich. And I'm up.